Hi friends, this is Susie, your Candy Crush Guru, here to help you solve the puzzle of level 1414, where we have 40 moves to clear out 42 jelly and reach 82,000 points. And the way to do this is to clear out this frosting, which will open up this portal system, and then we have to clear out this frosting, which will open this portal system, and then we have to clear out this frosting to get everything to reach all the way down. So it's a little bit uh, boring in the beginning, sorry to say it, because when we have no moves to make, uh, or only one move possible. There's no strategy to employ whatsoever. Here though, instead of taking out a frosting, I am going to make a special. When I have the opportunity to make specials that can reach down into the other areas, I will do that. Now also, normally I would make this move here, but I do like taking out that frosting. And this is a, a traditionally difficult area to reach. But now I'm going to move over here because when I make this move, everything kind of flows through and I'm hoping to get some cascade. Generally, I move the lowest on the board I can get. This isn't the lowest, this is the middle section. This is considered the bottom and then it goes up from there. Really strange the way it's configured. You'll see that a lot on uh, some of the higher levels as well. Okay, so now what we're seeing is we're seeing more stripes going this way, which is excellent, because it's not only going to help us to clear out this frosting, it's going to help us to clear out this jelly we need to reach. So if I could make moves here, I would. I cannot. So then I look to here. I cannot. So then I look to here. And again, I'm kind of limited in what I can do. There we go. Striped or wrapped? I'm going two stripes here because it'll help me to influence this area. And then also I get this through here. Okay, so now I can make a move here. Well, first I'm going to do the special. And now I'm going to make this move. And I have to work on trying to reach this area here. And this is one way to do it. Remember, I always have to be looking. Now, unfortunately, when I move down here or even here, this is going to slide through. Can I deploy that where it is? No, I don't see that opportunity. So I'm going to do this. And now this just may still help. Oh, and I can make another one of these. Now, can I deploy it where it is? That would be my preference. Yes, there we go. And now we're in here, and now with things sliding through, we'll have a greater opportunity to take this out just by the power of Cascade. There we go. So now my strategy is going to be kind of twofold. The farther down here I can get, the better. But also I'm going to be looking to take out things that may be double thick, or things in the corners. So this is double thick. I'll try to take this out. Uh, if I could set that off where it is, I would. It's The problem is this whole thing is just riddled with corners. Huh, I don't have very many good moves. Working low to the ground will help to encourage that uh, potential for more moves as the cascade runs through. Oh, if this stays, no, no orange here. Ah, but look at this. I can get up to that top area. Now, can I get these together? It's always a little bit tough to do because they're the same color and they may detonate. If I try, yeah, see at that point in time it will detonate. That's okay though, we need to change what's happening over here to get up in this area. So now I have six more, one, two, three, four, five, six. And this is actually looking pretty good. I probably should have taken out the orange, thankfully I have another shot at it. Here I should probably be working farther up on the scale. If I can, if I can make a move here. Because this, if I can get it to detonate, this should do it. It'll take out two layers. 
I made some mistakes when I should have worked up here and then worked down. I worked down here, but thankfully I was able to get it to work at the very end. And this was only my second or third playthrough. Sorry, I lost track. But it didn't take long to figure this out and to get this done. If you'd like to see more videos, you can subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.